we can use the graph palette objects to plot numeric data on a graph chart or plot the availability of graph and chart controls and indicators may vary depending on the sub palette style that we choose from amongst the modern next gen style silver system or classic sub palettes for graph controls and indicator availability So waveform chart and waveform graph, you can use these to display data typically acquired at a constant rate. Then we have XY graph, which displays data acquired at a non-constant rate and data for multi-valued functions. Then we have express XY graph which displays the same data on as an XY graph. We can configure the settings of an XY graph interactively through a dialog box. Then we have intensity chart and intensity graph, which displays 3D data on a 2D plot by using color to display the values of the third dimension. Then we have a digital waveform graph which displays data as pulses or groups of digital lines. Then we have a mixed signal graph which displays data types accepted by waveform graphs, XY graphs, digital waveform graphs and clusters that contain any combination of those data types. Then we have compost Compass uh, plot displays vectors that emanate from the center of a circular grid. Error bar plot displays uh, error bars at each point above and below a line graph. Feather plot displays vectors that emanate from equally spaced points along a horizontal axis. XY plot matrix displays rows and columns of scalar graphs. Then we have 3D picture which displays uh, graphical representations of 3D objects. Then we have two sub palettes, one for controls and one for 3D graph. The controls uh, uh, sub palette can be used uh, to display advanced graphs and graphical representations of 2D objects. The 3D graph can be used uh, to plot data in 3D. So let's have a peek at the controls. Uh, sub palette. Uh, we can use the control sub palette objects to display advanced graphs and graphical representations of 2D objects. So we have a polar uh, plot which displays data represented by polar coordinates. We have Smith plot which displays complex reflection coefficients corresponding to complex impedances on a polar plot. The min-max plot displays the minimum and maximum of a plot. We have distribution plot which displays a frequency histogram. Then we have radar plot displays multivariate data in a circular plot with one axis for each variable. Then we have 2D picture which displays a graphical representation of 2D objects. Then we have the sub palette data types. You can use the data type sub palette objects with picture function VIs and 2D picture control to 
create visual representations of data. So uh, the data type sub palette, we, we can use the data type sub palette objects with picture function VIs and 2D picture controls to create visual representations of data. Let's have a peek inside and here we will find point control. We can use uh, to define X and Y coordinates for a point. We have rectangle control which we can use to define the corners of a rectangle. Then we have font enum which we can use to select either a user specified font or one of three built-in fonts which are application font, system font and dialog font. Then there is the user font uh, control which we can use when font enum is set to user specified font to specify font, text size and text formatting. Next we have text alignment which we can use to set the horizontal and vertical alignment of text. Next we have a 3D graph a sub palette. We can use the 3D graph palette objects to plot data in 3D. So let's have a peek inside 3D graph pa sub palette. And we have scatter. Scatter graph uh, which displays the relationship between two variables as a set of discrete points. Bar displays a vertical bar graph. Pi displays a pie chart. Ribbon displays a parallel line plot. Contour displays a curve along with a function with two variables with, uh, which has a constant value. Uh, quiver displays the vector arrows representing the magnitude and direction of a set of points. Quiver, quiver plots are also known as vector fields. Comet displays an animated graph with a circle that follows the data points. Surface displays data with a connecting surface. Mesh displays a mesh surface with open spaces. Waterfall displays the surface of the data and the area on the y-axis below the data points. 3D surface graph which displays the 3D data with a connecting surface. 3D parametric graph which displays a graph with the x, y and z variables are each functions of a common parameter. The 3D line graph which displays a line or curve in terms of x, y and z points.